beautiful. And then you get your jar. Marina. We have just stopped for some breakfast. I had scrambled eggs on toast. Alex had scrambled eggs and beans on toast. Boom. We both had a hot chocolate. Um, although I forgot Alex doesn't like the cream, so I had all of her cream as well. So I had uh, double cream, which was fabulous. Anyway, it is now 11 o'clock. We've got a plan for the next two days. We are going to be walking to Pembroke Dock where there is a travel lodge and it is costing a grand total of £33, £30 for the room and £3 for Wi-Fi for two devices. That's up the there. Way. Yeah, we're going the wrong way. Sorry, that was me. Yeah, basically we're on this dock front and we don't know if we could carry on walking if we can get up back up to the main road at the very end. Logically, you would think yes, but we basically just can't face walking to the very end and then being like, no. Yeah, but on the map it doesn't say that there is a yeah we, get up there. we will go through the boat yard that's the way we came <laughs> oh my god it's so confusing <laughs> it's been a hell of a morning we left at seven in the morning <sighs> 5 40. it's like are you awake i'm awake are you awake should we get up oh we don't want to it's raining and it's cold anyway we're gonna get to the travel lodge at three o'clock then we're gonna chill in the room we're gonna wash our socks i might do some yoga I mean, very exciting stuff. Uh, and then the following day, we've got a big day, like 23 miles to get to a campsite. Alex called them up, five quid, whoop, whoop, for, uh, for a tent, winning. We love prices like that. And this is where we need to go. We need to go bang left over here. And that's a special price for walkers, by the way. Oh, a special price for walkers. Special price. That's what we like to hear, special price for walkers, yeah. Okay. Oh, oh God. Okay, come on, go, come on, go. You can do it. This is the realities when you stop walking for a while, your legs seize up and you're walking along like this. Oh! <laughs> and then slowly, your back will straighten, you'll get a little straighter, and then you'll get your jab. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Some of us are walking backwards. Hello. Yeah, please stand up. <laughs> <laughs> thought you were, were going to gonna trip on something. Oh, no. Love it. Love it. What's wrong with you today? <laughs> What's wrong with you today? <laughs> What's wrong with me today? I don't know. Okay. Where are Moaning, we? Moaning, Moaning. Like, oh, the scrambled eggs. Oh, they were so disgusting. <laughs> but three pounds sixty. Like, I mean, I was expecting a little bit more. Uh, which Where way? Where are we going? <laughs> we don't know! Oh my god! As we walk through Milford Haven, you can see the stunning and beautiful views. Gotcha. <laughs> I don't know what is wrong with me. Anyway, we've got some statues here. Let's go check out the statue. I don't, I don't know. So this says, Pembrokeshire, reflect on your people. Through them flows our nation's energy. And there's also like fish things on the floor. And what's this say? To be, to be wise, one must ever reflect from many one purpose, safety, service, pride. Okay. And then we've got our second statue. Thanks to them, Milford Haven flourished. Probably more like 10 and a bit miles but we're doing well this is just 
basically there's just a refinery on the other side so but you know what i'm very grateful that they put this here to make it easy for us to walk through so yeah refinery gas uh ooh, irish ferry into the forest we go we're walking through like an orange cage uh bit see-through on the floor the wind is coming in or you know this does my head in like when i look down it's like oh it's like makes my head go funny this is the view these are the gas lines there's the irish ferry there's alex Woohoo! but you know what i think i said this before i'm still grateful that they put it in so that at least we can walk this beautiful part of the coast and not have to do a massive inland detour. Oh, that's nice, out of the wind. That way. I love the fern in like their, in their infancy, you know, where they're all curly and cool. Aww. doing super well so quite a bit of road walking today not the most scenic but these houses are pretty loving the colors so over there you can see the bridge we are going to be crossing over that bridge and heading down into Pembroke docks where we are going to be staying at a travel lodge one of the awesome things about traveling with a friend is that you get to split the cost of a room and the travel lodge is normally 30 quid so obviously 15 quid each and we threw in some wi-fi for an extra three pounds so yeah, £16.50 each, which you know what, is fantastic. Check-in is at three o'clock and we are just hoping to get there and have a proper sort of relax, relaxation type of type of day. So yeah, let's keep on, keep on trucking. But that's where we're heading. That bridge down into town, boom. <laughs> dock right over this bridge down the other side and we are good to go Woo! here we go Ooh. team it's 2 30 and now we come out into this area where uh, it's like a shopping park that white building over there that is the travel lodge but we can't get in there till three o'clock so we've got half an hour to do our resupply get our food so we've got a little right there and then we've got an Asda over on the far side. Let's go food shopping. I am going to try and be healthy. So basically what I'm buying now is dinner for tonight and breakfast for tomorrow morning. And then I'm pretty good for food still. Because obviously I did that massive respite at the cult where I spent like 50 quid. So I don't want to do that again. Okay, blueberries. They're nice and healthy. Ooh, maybe a fruit salad. Did you realise we were together because of the smell? <laughs> 26 things, please. I'm a crisp. <laughs> I'm going to have to carry my tent and my crisps. Like, they can't wait all fit in. Pretty big. Yay! Dinner, breakfast, lunch, sorted. And I've still got food as well from my last big shop. Time is 2.56, four minutes before check-in. Can I get a whoop whoop? Travel logs. Oh, thank you. Almost there, almost there. Room 113. Lovely. Oh, look, look 
Yin yoga. Oh, I can. I can do some yin yoga. Fantastic. Oh, well, we've made it, team. Oh. Ah. Oh, it does have a bath. Uh, Better quick go to Wilco's, get some salt. I know. I was, I was debating should I go and buy some Epsom salts to have a proper bath. Um, I was going to wash my hair as well, but I don't think they have any stuff. Hair and body wash. Yeah. Oh, gross. <laughs> I'm just checking it was still you know, working. Now I've got a handful of gunk, okay. <laughs> More realities of life when you're hiking. Look at oh. Alex's socks. Oh, <laughs> that is rancid. Uh, we've put our stinky shoes in the corner. Uh, I'm just laying out the food. So we got some crisps. I'm also gonna treat myself, cheeky gin and tonic, be a bit healthy, berry boost. We've got some chicken, avocado, fruit. I haven't tried these ones yet, but I'm a bit sick of all my other ones. So I thought let's give apple crumble a go. So, and some croissants for breakfast, some hummus. I don't know, I just thought some pomegranate seeds would be healthy. Okay, clothes are going here, windows are open, let the air in. Mm -hmm.